This is a story all about how my tablet's life got flipped upside down and I'd like to take a minute so just sit right there and I'll tell you how the Prime pulled out my hair! In 2012, the money I raised bought me a Transformer prize to feed my tablet craze. Chilling out, maxing, relaxing, all cool, playing on the gadget that made you drool. Wearing a couple of things on the box under the address said it had Bluetooth, Wi-Fi and GPS. So I had a little playtest, but it was apparent to me that the GPS wasn't all it was promised to be. I checked on the forums to see if I was alone, but found others with a much angrier tone. Aza sucks, it mostly said, a reputation tarnished and tucked into bed. It's a minor flaw, you have to admit, on a device suffering from all sorts of disturbing shit. Broken Wi-Fi, reboots and light bleed, those are the real killers of this machine. But someone there in the ivory tower has decreed that first we need GPS power. So the fix was announced, proud and true, a GPS dongle for every one of you. And rejoice. It's not unusual to be loved by anyone. It's not unusual to have fun with anyone A GPS fix, that's awfully nice And it was free, absolutely no price Visit the site and apply online It was delivered soon after, ready for the prime I would usually chuck away the extra crap But hey, I'm a sucker for bubble wrap The first thing I noticed was the packaging It was smart and neat, very interesting Do they plan to sell the stock to those without a transformer dock? The dongle's the size of a highlighter pen, it slots into the tablet's docking den. At first I thought that was odd to me, why don't they just use a free USB? And then I was reminded by a mate, not everyone has a dock that can take the bait. So plug it straight into the tablet, but charge it first or else you've had it. Now as you can see, the result is great, the GPS works, no need to hate. Satellites, satellites everywhere, but in all honesty, does anyone really care? I can think of three people off the mark, Captains, Pilots and Tony Stark. But unless you decide to pimp your car, I can't see this device going very far. The problem is, the numbers are wrong. As you can see with this audacious song, GPS is broken for 80%, but the number who use it is probably 5%. But Wi-Fi is bust for about a quarter. Everyone uses the wireless water. We needed a fix to access the net, but a GPS fix is all we get. Such a crime